All right, let's look at the door exercise number two. This one says that the movement will halt immediately when a stop switch is initially pressed and will remain halted if the switch is released. Um, pressing the open switch um, is no longer momentary. Um, the opening operation will continue um, the completion even when the switch is released. So it's a momentary switch, but you're going to seal in that circuit for both the open and the closed. So we have a stop switch, two seal-ins for open and closed. The rest of this stuff right here is the same. Coming down to the ajar lamp, um, that's new. And it's saying that if the, um, the ajar lamp will be lit if the door is not in either the fully closed or the fully open position. So let's go ahead and download this and see how it operates. You um, download, run, and notice it's got a shut indication lamp that we have from exercise one. But if I hit the open, I only do it once and then it's um, sealed in and goes all the way out. If I hit the close switch and hit the stop, I can go back to open, stop, close, stop. And notice the whole time that I'm not either uh, fully closed or fully open, I'm ajar. If I go all the way up, the ajar light um, is no longer lit or illuminated and the open switch is, is uh, illuminated. If I go to close it and fully close it, you'll notice the ajar light is lit until it gets fully closed and then the shut light. That's exercise two.